Facebook Live from the TFP. There we are. There we are. You might recognize this one. Y'all have told us, TFP, that you want more TFP Chattahooligans, so we are tailgating. We are, we are live at the Chattahooligan pre-game tailgate extravaganza. We just call it a tailgate for short, though. Okay, and this is Galen Riley. He's the, what would you call yourself of the hooligan? I, I'm, I'm just, just a Chattahooligan. We're all, we're all in the same You're crew. All the same. All I stand up front because I'm really short. <laughs> That's the reason. Investigative recording, tailgating. Let's go. So this is one of many little areas. Hey guys. Hey. Oh You need more beer. Okay. Sweet Let, thank, thank, you guys. thank you. So we're, I think we're gonna run this way. Let's follow we have Galen. Some special, special guest. Okay. Ba babies here too. Family friendly all the time. Chattahooligans Heart Knox chapter. They drive down from like, Knoxville has a team, but our team is way better and way more fun. So these delightful people have drive down every week and we're gonna hang a banner over next to our section tonight for them. Cool. Yeah, right? beautiful. Yeah, so they painted a banner like in their garage and we're gonna hang it over the front of the section. So they're repping. We painted it on the parking lot of our parking Whatever, same thing, same thing. Hey, let's go talk to her real quick. Oh, yeah. Oh, you, you, you exposed yourself as participating. Okay, so what did you say about the banner? We painted it in the parking lot of our apartment complex. We don't have a garage. And why did you guys choose to get involved and come here and repeat? Oh, hopefully Will. Okay, Will. Hey, Will. Will. Okay, Will. He's why? from Cleveland, so okay. he's kind of from like the area. From the area. I knew I was so sweet. Here, we'll talk talk to us here at Facebook Live. So you got all your friends who aren't even from Chattanooga. No, I mean, those who are from Atlanta, people, the rest of them are from Knoxville as well. So just from my uh, friend group up in Easy. Why do you love it? Why do you love coming? Well, so my family's from Liverpool, so soccer is part of our life. So being a massive Liverpool fan, having a club that has a lot that emulates a lot of the passion that the fan base in Liverpool does is really, really nice and it's a really good job. Can you believe it's in Chattanooga? I cannot believe it, and it's true. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Cool. It's because people like him. Yeah, um, he, he's a good one. We have a beautiful community here. Definitely. Also, you'll notice if you pan just above your head, we are under the comforts of the first Tennessee Pavilion today. Wow. Because the weather forecast was for 102. Ouch. But, but unfortunately, we've had some clouds, but uh, the... Shout out to, to Paul Smith and Brian Wright and Haley and the entire Finley uh, crowd for making this happen. It's, it's, it's quite luxurious when you have shade in bathrooms versus like a parking lot. So yeah, those are key. Shout out to those guys. Those people. Oh, yeah, let's walk. Wow, look at the line out there. Holy okay. cow. Yeah. So people are showing up. The weather is kind of questionable, but, you know. Yeah, we're an hour and a half from kickoff right now, and there's a line out of the gate. Very cool. That is insane. Okay, let's, let's, wow. let's go wow. hang out with some more of these tailgaters. Oh. Let's follow Galen. Everybody. Hey, hey, 
Hey, Ernie. Leslie, I'm with the Times Free Press. This is our TFP Live. Cannot get this because uh, my dad's a pastor, so okay. I'm going to hide the booze in the cigar. Pastors kids never drink. So you better delete here. that or I will take the phone and shatter it. Yeah, okay. Hello. So, besides all that, Dad. Our um, Ernie's our very first drummer. So I met Ernie. He didn't even have a drum at the time. He had like a, like a, like a, like a, a, a He had a paint bucket. Well, that too, yeah, I had the paint bucket. That was in Atlanta. Yes, he remembers back to those days. So this guy, he came, he was quiet at first, oh. and now he's like the, he's the guy that's turning the gears to the entire machine. Oh, this is one yeah. oh, it's right. So we're in Atlanta. Yeah. So I had gone down to Atlanta. It was the first game of the season, and also the first weekend of the Six Flags Water Park. Okay. And they happened to be sort of close to each other. Yeah. I can't believe so I was like, sure, I'll go to this game. So Ernie has like a hatchet handle and a paint bucket, and the paint bucket explodes. Oh. And there's oh, yeah. shards of plastic everywhere. It was a beautiful moment. Okay. That's when you got like your real drum. Yeah, I think a good drum. It was very, it's very DIY. Very DIY. I like well, it. you know, I was thinking like, those after, are beautiful things. After baseball games, you know, to see those guys on the sidewalk playing with their buckets and playing the drums. It blew up. Okay. It didn't work. I was bleeding at the end of that night in Atlanta because I got a plastic shard that raised my head. But it was worth it. That's actually a fake leg. Yeah. It's and you can see he's still got the wound from it. That band-aid is seven years old. Yeah. <laughs> so. These guys are hardcore if you can't tell. Uh, DIY, drumming, bloodshed. We're not going to do all that tonight. Not at I mean, least right knows? now with the tailgate part of it. We're going to walk around tomorrow night to meet you. Ernie. We'll see you drumming later. No, I didn't bring my drum set. No, okay. Alright. Alright. There's so many drums, it's fine. Alright. Quick question for you. Professional question. A professional question, live. This is not a video. Well, no, this is live. It's okay. being videoed. So I write novels. Okay. What do I need to do to do a press release well, for anyone? Because here's the deal. Yeah. I've talked a lot of best seller charts. Okay. But I've never done a press release. I'm going to be honest with you, and I'm going to be honest with you guys who ask me questions like this. I will help you. I really will. E email me at ldale at timesrepress.com because it's a long explanation. Ldale? At timesrepress.com. So anybody who has questions, ldale at timesrepress.com, and I will answer any sort of media questions. There were no beers just to help. Nobody For else in this town is going to ask you that question. L. Damn. Sorry guys, at timesrepress.com. L-D-A-L-E. We're going to move on to the hooligans, but yeah, get a hold of me. I'll answer any questions. I really will. I promise. Okay, let's follow Galen. The next, the next stop on our tailgate tour, that was just on, is our, our merch page. Here's our merch page. We've got Kelly in the back, there's me, there's Nick, and Nicole, the other half of Chattahooligan Live. Half of Chattahooligan Live is behind the camera right now, Time Street Press. Okay, let's see what they have over here. So we have shirts and scarves for the most part. And we take all this money and we turn it into food and beverage and big giant flags and banners and stuff. So. Oh, cool. A lot of those sold through. We have actually a charity event on Tuesday, July 26th. Is that the right day? That's the right day. Tuesday the 26th. We have an annual veterans benefit called Hooligans for Heroes. And we're going to have a silent auction and some beer specials over at Yonder Brewery. Uh, so come to that as well. So that's all that goes through. Uh, this year's beneficiary is uh, Mash. It's a local veterans housing benefit. So. so what's this picture of? Oh. El Conductor, the guy in the hat and the mask, likes to, to cut action shots into silly situations. Okay. And it looks like we went on a little surfing excursion. Nobody has a life jacket, which is sort of troubling to me. Okay. So if you go in the water, you want to care about safety. Okay. But these yeah, guys, yeah. they're just they're just fancy free. So there's a lot of interesting, interesting stuff going on. People handing me pictures, asking me for my email in here. I like it. Very unvarnished. Yeah, yeah. Unvarnished territory. Okay. okay. Hopefully you can see like the whole We're gonna be yeah. <laughs> Okay. We're gonna make a bum rush for the founders. We're gonna go find the founders of the hooligans.
a treat for us to get to Also, like, you can't tell on the internet, but they're just rowdy as hell. Oh, okay. Yeah. They haven't shown their true colors yet. I'll be catching you all later. We'll be on the front row. Yeah, with this one, with Galen here. Because he doesn't seem like he would be as rowdy as he gets either. Yeah. I'm conserving my energy. And there's probably a lot of people like that who are part of this group who do their mom, dad stuff, work stuff by day and get to be a hooligan by CFC weekend game or, or a weekday game. Yeah, cool. All right, and let's sit, talk a little bit about tonight's game, Caitlin, real quick. If you're, if you're watching right now, you, kickoff is not for another hour, so get your butts up Finley right now. It is. I've got, I've got extra tickets in my pocket. Just find me and I'll give you a ticket. Just get here. It's going to be kidding. awesome and have a lot of fun. If you haven't been, if you have been, whatever. It's amazing. A beautiful thing. It's cool. So, and I'll get them later when they're all rowdy. When everyone's rowdy, I'll get some video later. For now, I am going to grab the camera from our Chattahooligans live expert, Carlos, who's been filming. Thank you. Thank you, Carlos. All of these TFE Facebook Lives are always filmed by somebody who's in it. So we really appreciate that. I'm going to grab the camera and walk around myself and show you what, what I see as an outsider. Because you guys are used to it. And then I'll be back later throughout oh, the game. That's what <laughs> uh, and we'll have more of these wonderful people in the Chattahoolin CFC game tonight. Okay, thank you, Carlos. I'm going to walk around. And we're going to yeah, we're gonna win. And they're going to win. So this is Thomas right behind us. This is Hi. Thomas Clark. Hi, Th Thomas. Hey, Thomas was once a defender, and he's a board member. Hey, Thomas. He's how not, are not you? Only is he a, he's a founder. He's a, a former player, and he's a current board member. So Thomas wears several hats. He's not literally wearing a literal hat right now, but he wears okay. several hats. Thomas, what, what do you think? We're hoping for 10,000 tonight. Awesome. Miami's going to be tough game. Uh, they're a hard team. Hard team. Hard they're, team. Hard. They're, they're a fully professional side. So. Okay. So it's going to be. Uh, are hard. Are you a little nervous? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Honest, honest answer. Okay, I can tell your hands are crossed. You're getting yeah. serious about it. Yeah, it's game time. All right. What do you want to tell all these hooligans and all the fans about how they can they can help bring it home? Uh, cheer that much louder. They already cheer incredibly loud. We're gonna need that extra push here tonight. Right, so soccer's kind of soccer's kind of weird versus other sports. Like, and, and if you're like a like a football game or whatever, you sort of, I mean, you, you can make noise before the snap or whatever. But but generally, you're sort of responding to what's happening on the field. I feel like in soccer, because so much of it, there's it's such a fluid game, and there's so much importance in it, just like communication as you go. That as a supporter, if you're if you're doing certain things, you can actually impact the flow of the game. So instead of reacting to the game, you're actually willing what's going to happen on the field. It's sort of beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Watch it play out. It's a symbiotic relationship. You know, it's good. Like, like we have a good time, and then people show up, and they have a good time, and then the players respond to to the crowd, and they win. Some more people show up. It's it's a beautiful, happy cycle. Cool. Thank you. Thank you, Thomas. Thank you. Good luck. Thank shake, you. shake it off. It's gonna be all right. I, will. I, have, I have a good feeling. Twenty minutes of the game, I'll be all right. Okay. All right. I will give it, I will give it I'll see you guys. Box. I'll see you guys later. I'm gonna just like show people what's going on. Some left. These were all full a moment ago, and it looks like we're starting to pack it up. It's leftovers time. Tell people why you all pack up so early, because you got to prep for your entrance. Yeah, every... so, well, number one, the, the, the stadium staff has been just delightful to us, so so we really want to leave the place spick and span, because they're, they're, they're so nice to us, and we want to clean up and make sure we're good citizens. Um, so typically what we do is we'll, we'll kind of round round the troops up, and at about 7 o'clock, a little after, we will parade into the stadium. If you typically show up right before kickoff, you might miss that, but the, the procession of the Charlie Hooligans into the stadium is, is sort of a beautiful thing to behold. So uh, we do a little pep talk, the drums make a whole lot of noise, and then we all enter the stadium at the same time, and it's an amazing thing. Where do you guys enter from? We, we, walk, in the, we walk in this front gate right over here. 
to sort of clog, clog up the entrance for a while, but it's fun. This is James Dawson. James Dawson is a local entrepreneur. Hey. Cheers. 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 How are you, James? I'm doing great. It's our birthday Leslie. week, Leslie. Leslie. With the Times Free Press. I'm doing great, Leslie, with the Times Free Press. Yeah, this is TFP Live. TFP Live? Yeah, we're live. I join you with my pass. I got one too. They Sweet. Me one. I How'd do, you get one of those? I do the Twitter stuff. Sometimes. Uh -huh. So. What do you think about the tailgate? This whole situation going on in I think here. It should, I think it should be like this every week. It's beautiful. Yeah. Me too. I think the fact that... I think the fact that we got all these folks out here that maybe aren't even always CSC fans because a good tailgate's a good tailgate. Yeah, definitely. Are you excited about tonight's game? Yeah, I'm excited. Why? Tell me I, why. I'm excited to the point. So I was on Facebook today. Yeah. I got a uh, one of those memories, you know what I mean, where yeah. they tell you, like, oh, this happened five years ago today. I was in Finley Stadium rooting for CFC. Really? So it was, it was kind of cool when that popped up where I was like, We've been doing this a while. We've been good for a while. Because if you're playing at the end of July, yeah. you know, you're winning games. Yeah, there's only eight teams left in the league right now. It's like 100 teams in the whole league. There's eight left. And after tonight, there's going to be only four. So Yeah, tell us what's ahead. Tell us what's so, ahead. So tonight is the South Region Final. So, so the league is divi divided up into four regions. Tonight, there's two teams left in the South. So it's effectively the national quarterfinal. So if we win the night, there will be a big trophy, which is really nice. I like trophies. Um, and then we go into the national round. So we'll have a semifinal and then a final. So hopefully three more weeks left of this beautiful, short, but, uh, but amazing season. Cool. Cool. Hope it lasts. All right. I'm going to keep going. Oh, we have the face painting station. Oh, face painting. That's new. Oh, it's, no, that's classy. I like it. It's going to sweat off. Right? There's, there's a lot of labor and detail. Why do you not want to brave heart? Why do you not want to brave heart? I'm going to sweat it off. Oh, We're gosh. live on the internet right now. Watch our F-bar. It's okay. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's on the internet. It's fine. I'm sorry. Yeah. Sometimes it's people say bad internet. things on the internet. It happens. Look at, yeah. look at this chick right here. Just look at what they're going to say in the comment section below this video. Probably other things. Right. The other way. Go the other way. Oh, we got to appreciate so, the art. We have somebody already out. Already out. Oh. <laughs> Got a young one. Okay. Let's see. People don't look like they're ready to go yet, Galen. They're holding on, but we're going to yell at them here in a minute. They're going to get over here. Are you angry? I am angry. Well, I am very angry. Okay, bear in mind we're on the internet. That's fine. Can I ask you why? Can I trust the answer to be I PG? Don't, I, don't, I don't like unsportsmanlike goalies who flop on minimal contracts. Okay, okay. Did you see Miami's goalie in their, their last game? I did not see, but I have heard. It was, it was pretty horrible. Okay. So. This team has a reputation for... I would say theatrics. That's a yeah. good. That's a good safe place. Yeah. Okay. You have to be really careful. So, so I, to don't, see. I, I don't like teams like that. I've never heard you guys seem like a little bit nervous about a team no, before. We're, we're no. nervous all the time. Okay. Okay. And weird things can happen. It's. it's yeah. It, you, you can, you know, I know. They, they can I score can't. A sweet goal and, I can't attribute the quote right now. The, the source escapes me, but it goes something like, "Like soccer is not a matter of life or death." It's much more important than that. So we're nervous every week. Okay. Yeah. It's a good quote. It's a good quote. Who says that? It's killing me. Whatever. I don't know. Somebody, okay. Somebody said that. It's a very smart person. All right. We're good. I think we're about right. to wrap up. Uh, I'm going to just walk you guys around one more time Thank through this so tailgating. Thank you, Galen. Thank you, Subscribe everyone. to your local newspaper. They do a great job. <laughs> Click on them ads and stuff. Thank you. Okay, and I'll, I'll have these guys later for you, too, during the game. No, I'm not. But I am a like, CFC you're, fan. You're a friend of the Chattahooligans? This guy inspired me to be a part of the Chattahooligan tailgate last year. Now you got to be part of the supporters section. <laughs> That's what our other friends say. I got to go get it. Okay. Here. Yeah. Like edit that out. Yeah. Oh, we're live, no, honey. We're live. So 
if you're new to the supporter section, we have the hooligan hymnal, which teaches you all the words to the song. So, like, oh, cool. we, we think of everything. We really do. You get there, the hymnals get passed out, so you, you can go up to speed immediately. As soon as your voice hurts, a bag of Ricola cough drops comes on through. Uh -huh. We're pretty smart. I don't want to brag, but we're pretty smart. Cool. Look at those little things. Okay. Awesome. So there we are. And Very it has cool. Yonder lyrics. So if I don't know if you've heard of the Chattanooga Choo Choo. That's an important one to know. Yeah, I think that ring, you know, rings a bell. All right, so if people want to join you guys, they could literally just show up and yeah. There's not like an initiation ritual. We don't we don't keep a roll. There's no dues you gotta pay. Uh, wear something blue. Might help you blend in a little better, but if not, that's fine. But yeah, come on down. Cool. We're a, we're a big happy family, and we would like you to come and join us. We also have a lot of fun. It is fun. People are very nice and welcoming. Except for Kevin. Very except, nice except and welcoming. for this guy. Oh. Why are you here? <laughs> that is a loaded question. You don't belong here. <laughs> Galen. Is he always like this? He's a theatrical actor, so he's, he's, he can do whatever he wants. You're okay. Uh, there's a small. Oh, you saw me. Uh, you saw me being friendly to someone. Lots out of character for just yeah. a second. Lots of characters I'm meeting in Amateurs. here tonight. Amateurs. Yes. The, the guy in the yellow shirt on? walking by. Are you the We're lady that does the uh, news thing? We're live. I've yes. watched you. You're I'm very her. good. I, like, oh, I thank enjoy your, your broadcast. Hey, thank you. You're way better than Harrison. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Just different, everybody. Just different. You be sure to put, post that. Th hey, thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> thank you. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, I like all the, um, people are really candid part of these chatta hooligans are very well, candid. It's really the, the thing about sort of, to make it work, like you can't be fake. Right. Like, if I just came here to like, you know, yank on your leg and tell you stuff that wasn't true, like, it wouldn't, it wouldn't be what it is. So, so like we value authenticity really kind of above everything else. We've got, we've got a great community. We've got, we've got kids. We've got people that are, that are advanced niggers. We have, you know what I'm just going to point this out, but if you pan the camera around, like, about half of the people in this tailgate right now are women, which you don't really think about when you think about sports culture, but, like, you know, that's something we're really proud of, so. Should be. And it's so cool that the founders are that mom and daughter. Tell Aren't me their names yet. again. Elizabeth. Liz and Bev. And totally cool, bad, cool women, and uh, they started all this, and everybody else. Yeah, and look what it's. Come it's, on, look at what it's, well, look at what's happened. It is, it is a celebration of the city that we all love. And on that note, we are finally going out. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll be back later. Thank you, Leslie. Thank you, TFP. See you at 7. TFP Live. Woo!